hello hello welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel my name is Demi and today I'm filming a collective haul which I haven't done in a while um, I actually found out I had COVID this morning which is really annoying very inconvenient so I mean I was gonna film this anyway but what else is there to do when you're stuck inside also how cute is my hair like this I feel like I'm definitely gonna wear it like this more because I feel like more people need to because it's so cute right first of all I'm gonna do jewelry so I did a little ASOS haul for some jewelry and I also got some from a vintage shop so firstly I have this I don't know if it'll be backwards on the thing but it just says Capricorn I'm feeling very Millie out of Love Island and that was from ASOS I could probably get the prices of things up as well actually. It was £10. I've always wanted one but yeah I feel like it's cute and then I also got these two rings. Oh shit. You see, it's, see it says mum and dad is that the right way? Yeah it looks back to front on the camera so I feel like it's probably not showing it right but it says mum, dad and I saw Molly McFarland had these and I just thought do you know what some people might think it's lame but I think it looks really cool. And I like, I just like having them together as well. It just looks really cool. And then I also got, I got this one from, God, it's focusing on me. I got this one from a vintage shop in Sheffield called Vulga, which is amazing. Um, while we're on the topic of Vulga, um, I got this bag from there as well. How cute are them little faces? They're just so me, and I've always, right, first of all, this is fake, because I could never afford the real, I think it's like three grand, but obviously they didn't know it was a fake, it's a vintage shop, so they probably just got it, realised it was a fake, so I asked if, they weren't selling it either, um, it was just like a thing that I did with them, uh, you probably saw on my Instagram, just the photos and stuff, so obviously I was doing the, the thing with them and they used it as a prop, and I said can I buy this, because it's just so cute I just love it but yeah so got that absolutely obsessed um but I also got these sunglasses I am obsessed like are these not 80s dad I literally love them um I love the little tinted and the little Thing here I will link everything down below that I can that was from ASOS I think they were like 10 or 12 pounds bargain but yeah really really love them and I think that's it for accessories I do I do think first clothing item is actually this cardigan that I've got on Um, I will actually film myself wearing it as well but it's cropped and the sleeves are like balloon sleeves I just love it. I absolutely love it. I love the stripe detailing. I love that it's got the little balloon sleeve. It's like the perfect length in crop. Even down to like the neckline, I really, really love. And this was from I Saw It First. Um, I also got a couple of other things from I Saw It First and I'll show you them as well. But this was literally, I, I want it in every colour. Um, it's just the perfect fit for me and I just love it and yeah. Um, let me see if I can show you it with like me wearing it. You see, it's like the perfect crop. And I just got. I, I have trainers all in the house. Please don't come for me. Do you know when you just? So basically, I went for a PCR test this morning. No one cares. I went for a PCR test this morning, and I've just realised actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to film it like this, so you can have a little show and tell, and that can be the background. So we'll just pop you there. Um, but yeah, basically, is this background good enough for people to see? Is that weird? Oh god, I'm selling on dog treats. Um, who cares? I went for a PCR test this morning, that's why I still have my shoes on. Anyway, this cardigan, we love it. We love to see it. I've, that's the washing machine. I've just got it on with these suit trousers from ASOS which I'm just obsessed with at the moment. Um, yeah, so, is, is this a good enough angle? Next 
Next item, should we do a, wait, I feel like I'm not gonna do this right, ready? Three, two, one. Woo, woo! This is a blazer, as you can tell. Um, basically, this I was, this was my outfit for today. I was meant to get out for breakfast. Then I came downstairs, saw my little lateral flow, and I thought, mmm, mmm. Are my eyes deceiving me? Apparently not, I did two more, and I thought, fuck. Anyway, not important. I don't know if you can see me, because my camera's quite far away. But this is a blazer that I got from Next. A pink blazer. I'm feeling very cute. Like, so basically, I, I have a lot of blazers, I wear a lot of blazers, but I just, I was getting in a rut of wearing like not colourful things, which is not very me. But this, I mean, I hope she's showing up cuteness on camera. We're obsessed. And this is a size six, but to be fair, she fits quite snug. I wouldn't be able to wear this as an oversized blazer, but I like it with the the suit trousers. Um, I would love some matching suit trousers. That would be really nice. But yeah, I feel like, is this not a vibe? And yeah, black buttons, black detailing, goes with the black stuff. I fucking love it. On to the next one, let's... I don't know if I just said that right. So, these trousers are from I Saw It First. I don't know if the angle's great on that. Let's hope it is. These are from I Saw It First. They're very cargo, baggy. Obviously, you can wear them high-waisted. I like to wear them like a little bit low-waisted. I hope this doesn't look shit. No, I can't, I love it. Um, and yeah, I just like the, let me just show you them properly. Um, I just bloody love these. I like wearing them with a hoodie, maybe a big jacket. Um, they're just so nice. And these cost me 16 pounds in the sale. Um, at first, when I first put them on, I was like, oh, these are far too baggy, far too big. Like, But when you're actually walking around in them, doing your thing, they're, these are like the comfiest trousers I've ever owned. Um, and then it's just got a drawstring waist. You can tie, tie, tighten, oh my God, or loosen, um, which is kind of nice, because then it's like, so I'm in between a six and an eight, and I got an eight, um, and that's because that's all they had in stock, but I really love them. So I will link these below. Um, I usually wear these with the cardigan as well. So with a cardigan or a, like a, an undone hoodie, because I don't like too much bagginess all around, but I just think it's so cute. Um, and let me show you these, I got these in green as well, so let me show you. Ready, three, two, one. So, aren't we just as obsessed? I just think, sorry, I'm wearing shoes on my floor, on my carpet, must be really annoying. But I literally am just obsessed. I feel like little, um, what was her name? Kim, Kim, with a little rat friend. Impossible, Kim Impossible, that was it. I'm feeling like, Kim Possible. That's what I feel like. Um, again, obsessed with these, they're super baggy. Cost me 16 pounds in the sale. Um, got size eight again. Um, I just bloody love them, they're so nice. And I love, I love baggy trousers at the moment. And I really wanted some trousers like this that weren't gonna cost me 60 odd pound. Urban Outfitters, I'm looking at you. You know who you are. But I saw it first, really did do something with these and I'm obsessed. I hope I'm gonna show you this well enough, but can you see the the triangle? And then the back is just tied like this. And then same around the neck. Um, I feel like this is definitely gonna be better for holidays, but I'm, I literally love this. I feel like, oh, it's a bit annoying with the necklace, apologies. But I feel like a Y2K, is that what they call it? Queen. It's like, you can't see your tummy, this hides it. I really hope you can't see my nipples. But I probably could do with this being a bit tighter. But I do really, really like this. This was like twelve pounds off vintage. She is selling more, so I will link because there is more. There is more to be bought, guys. Sorry. But yeah, 
so cute right literally so cute so i bought a couple of things from vinted that are respectively a big fat and no and i'm gonna sell because they just don't look right i mean first of all is this i'm feeling like aladdin it's not as cute as i would have liked it to be it's a bit maybe a bit too big on me look at that but this is cute like if it fit and this was a bit more fitted if i was taller then yes absolutely this would have been a big fat yes from me but as you can see it's just a bit big so i will be selling this if anybody wants it because she is cute but she's giving aladdin you see i like this i like the one sleeve i like this it's just the fact that it's a bodycon but i do love that's all twisted let's just ignore that but i do love the dress the idea of the dress very cute but the actual the fact it's a bodycon you can see my pants because they're all bunched the fact it's a bodycon really puts me off but i'm thinking if i keep it i might wear it with like a big blazer big blazer trainers or something it could be quite cute actually so i might keep it um this is all twisted actually i'm so confused what have i done wrong here this just isn't sat on me right maybe it is more like that yeah this isn't right on me one second it's a bit oh right no that's a bit better i don't know if that looks any different but that is now sat on me correctly whereas before it really wasn't but yeah i really love this this whole area is very very nice and it is quite flattering but do you know that trend where it's like i'm shy i'm so shy about being in tight clothes that is me all over i'm shy in a tight dress very shy but from afar she's looking cute so i do really love this neckline so maybe i will keep it actually let me know below what you think what do you think god that's not i've got a little orange bag as well so i also bought this from ego official obviously ego is ego does a lot of dupes um so my fake balenciaga is from ego whereas this is I don't know if this is a fake, but I don't know what this is meant to be. Maybe a fake Balenciaga, but they just do it so well. Like, I just like the bag in general. I don't know what it's meant to be a fake of, but cute, right? So I got this as well, and that was $29.99 or something. But it does come with a strap, so you can wear it across your butt. These aren't the same orange, but the idea is there, right? Oh, hi. Hey. Me and my little bag, my orange dress. Maybe I will keep this dress. Maybe I'm convincing myself right now. I can't see what it looks like, but I'm feeling like it looks cute, but my vision is blurred and you are far away. Next is this dress from Kiwi and Co. See the back? Wait, let's make sure it's not all twisted. But I think this is the cutest ever. I definitely wear it with trainers or loafers. I really love this detail in here. It's a bit skew width, but and I like the the baggy sleeves. Very cute, absolutely obsessed. I also got this from Vinted, but it is from Kiwi & Co. Um, I just absolutely love it, I do, I'm obsessed. Um, but yeah, so, love, 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 absolutely love this. I got a size six, um, and it fits perfectly. It's quite stretchy material. Um, it just looks so cute. And obviously I got it second hand, so I got a bit of a bag, you know what it babe? Um, I just love it. And the girl on the website is wearing loafers with it. So I probably would wear white socks and loafers because that looks really cute, little, little bag. Show you my pink little bag. Obsessed. See, I don't like tight dresses like the Stesso one I just had on. This is absolutely fine because there's something going on here. It's got the big sleeves, it's quite... I feel like it's because I've dressed it down, whereas I don't... Oh, the heels, it's heels that do it for me. I just don't like myself in heels at all. Um, but yeah, bloody obsessed with this. Love the sleeves, love the fit, love this little bit. So cute, is it not? But yeah, love it, babe. So I've not tried this on yet, so I wanted to 
get my live reaction of it. But I got the Collusion unisex blazer. So I'm quite a petite lady. So I don't know if this is going to fit right or if it's just going to be huge, huge. But let's see, let's see. I don't know if it looks weird because I don't know what this looks like. <laughs> this looks like. Let me go and look in a mirror. Give me two seconds. You don't understand. I'm obsessed. See, you like like I said about that other blazer, the pink one. Look, this is it with my loafers. With the other blazer, I couldn't wear that like this because it's too fitted. Uh, Charlie, that's plastic. Let's not use that for tapes. Um. Whereas this, this is quite oversized. I probably should have gone for an extra small, but I'm nonetheless, love it, fucking love it. So it's quite thin material, I'm not gonna lie, but I love, I like it when the sleeves come like this, to like on your hands, love that for me. Um, but yeah, I feel like if I actually end up going on holiday, hopefully, this could be like a, a chilled evening outfit, do you know what I mean? I just love oversized blazers with dresses and then a dress down shoe. So I'm liking this with the loafers, definitely. Dark green. It's a win from me. I really like it. I hope it shows up on camera how nice it is because I do love it. And I like how long it is. I like that it's past the length of the dress. That makes it easier to, to layer like so. Next, we have ASOS again. This dress. Big commotion for the dress, please. Thank you. Mm, let's not do that dress. So I'm usually between six and an eight and I got four because that's the only way the back wouldn't be gaping loads. I don't know if I actually tied this up right. But it's ASOS design and I like the way it's tied at the back because it kind of cinches you in a little bit, which is what I need from a slip dress. Because if not, it's not gonna work. I, I love this. I bloody love it. I've had to boob tape myself here because every time I'd run up the stairs, boobs out. If I'd bend over, boobs out. So I actually bought this dress for, for Girlies Are Out. You've probably seen it if you've seen my Girlies Are Out vlog. Let me just put this up a little bit. My camera's going to die. Let's just hope it doesn't. But yeah, I really love this. Um, I wore this with a black oversized blazer. Um, I just like the way it cinches in a little bit because I've not got a, an amazing body oddy oddy. But that is fine. Um, I like the way it fits and yeah. So I'm not a heel gal usually, but I needed some for girlies are out. So I got platform, they're public desire, but I got them on ASOS. And this diamonty thing goes around the ankle and it's really cute. I'm not gonna put them on because I don't look, I don't like myself in heels, but I'm thinking I'd like these with trousers, maybe. I like these. Woo! These are from ASOS. Also, I'm starting to feel ill now. If I sit and don't do anything, then I feel ill. But if I'm doing something like this, then I'm fine. God, let me try and get the angles right. So these trousers are from ASOS. What do we think? Do we like? Because I do. They're really cute. I just really wanted some pink trousers and hopefully, um, I'm gonna get like some colourful top to go with it because I really do like them. They're like a linen-y material. I got six. I like how the bottom is kind of like lied, lied wig. <coughs> like that they're wide leg. And they're really comfortable because they're not too tight, which I like. They're just very comfy. They have pockets, which is a bonus. We like pockets. Um, but yeah, really, really like these. Very cute. Very good, very nice. Very good, very nice. See, very cute. I honestly think that is everything. <sighs> Sorry. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this vlog, uh, it's not a vlog. If you enjoyed this haul, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please subscribe, it helps so much. Like, even if you just click on and watch my videos in general, if they just pop up, please subscribe. I love it. Please subscribe. I appreciate it so much. Um, yeah, thanks for watching again. I'll see you next week with another video. Goodbye.